This night marked the beginning of the rivalry between Brett and Owen Hart in the WWF. The ref would stop Brett and Owen's match against the Quebecers for the tag team titles because Brett had an injured knee. And afterwards, Owen would kick Brett's leg out from underneath him and call him selfish in a backstage interview. So rumor has it that Vince didn't want this feud to happen. And Bruce has actually quoted Vince as saying, brothers don't fight. Uh, so, Ted, what, do you, what did you think about Owen and Brett turning against each other in this era? Well, you know, I don't, I don't really, gosh, it was like, um, I kind of looked at it like, well, you know, that's, you know, it's work, you know, it's, it's not, it's just, they're not really turning on, on each other. It's like, you know, one guy's going to turn heel and the other guy's going to stay baby face. And it's just, it's a, it's a, it's something new and different, you know, you know, but, but, uh, and then, uh, especially where you have two brothers involved and everybody knows their brothers and everybody knows the history that, that their dad actually promoted wrestling, you know, up in Calgary for years. So, I mean, everybody knew that, all, you know, the wrestling fans that, you know, go and pick all that stuff out. They, they find all that stuff out. And so, um, uh, I, you know, I didn't look at it as, as really a big deal and, and other than it was different. And, you know, there's always, you know, down the road, uh, you know, uh, you can, you can arrange something in a match where, uh, one brother gets in trouble and the other brother, despite their differences, runs to his runs to runs to his rescue. And that's something how it would like go. That. Yeah, something like that to reunite them. That's how it would go. Like three years later, they they got back together and you know they formed the New Heart Foundation. But uh, but yeah, it's I mean, and Owen was so good at playing like the bratty, hateable heel at this yeah. time, who yeah. just like resented his brother for all of his success. I oh, mean, it man. came off great, didn't it? Yeah. And and to this day, I mean, uh, what a whew, Owen has so much ahead of me. Uh, so, you know, so many, so many things he could have done had he not fallen. Oh, that's just, it's just unbelievable. Awful. And you know, it's at this time in 94, uh, you could argue it's, it's probably between Brett Owen and Shawn Michaels is the best in ring technician in all of professional wrestling bar none. Now, if you had to choose between the work of Brett and Owen, uh, who are you going with? Who's better? Oh wow! I know it's tough. I I think I still go with Brett. Okay. You know, um, I, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. That's a really tough one. Brett was a little closer to your style. I think Owen was kind of starting to usher in that that uh, age of kind of awesome high flying technical moves as well mixed in. So it's like Owen had a little bit more to offer from like a maybe an entertainment standpoint. But man, when it came to just being a technician, it was hard to beat Bret Hart. Yeah, yeah. Well, and that's it. It's we came from the same school of psychology of what wrestling is. And, and how you how you make it, you know, same mentality. 